What's up, my beautiful people? My lighting is not excellent today, but uh, I'm about to get down. Can you can you explain to me what I got? Just explain to my, my people what I got. Okay, so today you are having a traditionally Ghanaian meal. Hello. Uh, this is banku with stewed okra and a, basically it's an air fried red snapper with avocado and a little bit of pepper right here on the side uh, for that extra spiciness. Uh, this is a very popular meal in Ghana um, for dinner or lunch. So enjoy it. Y'all gonna have to enjoy me watching it. <laughs> enjoy me eating it because y'all gonna be watching. Y'all know how I get down. Uh, I'm trying to get this. I left my tripod again, y'all. I'm sorry. That's why I didn't upload the video the other day when I was at the um, the uh, seafood buffet. But I'm still going to upload it. But I had it sitting up on a napkin holder and salt and pepper shakers and all kind of stuff around it. I had it perfect at first. Something's just not. No, you don't have to sit there and hold it. Okay. We're going to get this together, y'all. That's why I see you need a bottle. Okay. Now, this is, come look at this. What y'all gonna be able to get is just. The plate. And you eating it very good. Yeah. That's so cool. this food, you really are supposed to eat it with your hands. Yep. So you can get a little bit of each one. And that one. This is the banku like your starch. So what you would do is like make it into another little ball. They take it, make it into a ball, then dip it. Mm -hmm. Together with the okra. Ooh. See that? <laughs> One fist. Hey y'all. <laughs> Hey y'all. <laughs> and the heat just kicked in. Yes. Perfect timing. Yes. Listen, they are right around the corner from me. What is the address, sister? 2816 Crumbs Lane. 2816 Crumbs Lane, here in Louisville, Kentucky. I am so glad that they moved. Well that they that they are around the corner from me. Oh my goodness, y'all. I'm using my hands today. Yeah, grab your big piece and make a nice circle. What I probably do, y'all, I'm sorry. What I probably do, y'all, stop this video in a little while and start a new one because this plate right here is what you call plate number one. Hey. I'm not playing today. God, <laughs> flavors. When, I'm, when I say flavors, this is how I cook. Y'all know how I cook. They can just see the flavors on the phone. On the, <laughs> I swear, they can just see the flavors in oh, my yeah, face. Sure. And this is where it's at, y'all. Oh. It's exactly what I expected. Yes. That good goodness, just to keep it nice and warm. Now this is pepper sauce? That is ginger and peppers, straight. What kind of peppers? Uh, scotch bonnets. Oh my God, excuse me, y'all. ginger which we put it in all of our food anyway but when somebody says they like spicy oh give them god. spice oh my god y'all i'm stuck y'all this is it this is the spot got a few um restaurants like this in the city but and i've eaten it almost all of them after this halfway through this plate we might get number one for me. Yay. Oh my God. You should feel like some ginger and pepper, good seasonings on the fish too. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I'm just trying to give me a nice, nice, piece. nice flow mm -hmm. where I can get down in two or three pieces with it without bones, so. Oh, so each little square where we make the slices mm -hmm. is all the meat. 
So if you remove just that piece, you won't have any bone. We've just sliced the fillets already for you. I gotta you just pick off the meats. I gotta get used to um, doing it the right way because I'm so used to eating it with a fork. So sure. normally when I eat this fish, just cook this way. Sure. And I separate it with the fork. Just a big hunk. Sure, sure, sure. How do you see the fish? Hmm? How, does, how does it taste? Perfect. Yay. It's perfect. Y'all already know I'm a critic. I ain't gonna lie to nobody. <laughs> it's right. Well, if you don't like it, we would like, we like uh, criticism or whatever. If it's too spicy or... This is perfect and I, and I, yeah, this is perfect. <laughs> <laughs> Good. We appreciate it. Thank you so much for your business. You're welcome. It's worth it. That's Definitely worth it. Out of the picture. <laughs> you got um, indefinite flavors, y'all. Yeah, the flavors are crazy on that one. Oh, man. The palm oil comes through so nicely. Yes. Thank you. Africa House, y'all. Cane Run Road. I mean, sorry. The, the address again? The 2816 Crumbs Lane. 2816 Crumbs Lane, Louisville, Kentucky. Me? Oh. Yeah. Yeah, I can't talk too loud. I have somebody in the room who's praying, so y'all got to watch me eat for a minute. Oh man. Now this flavor is good. This was so this is the snapper. This is the snapper. Y'all the price is right, I promise you. The price is right. The snap is right. It's delicious. Mm. I have my mango juice. Oh yeah. I hope the lighting's okay for y'all. I apologize again for leaving my, <laughs> for forgetting my tripod at home. Yeah, I feel so much better. You know what I'm getting ready to get now? After this plate, I have to taste the pepper soup. I've been hearing about their pepper soup. Most definitely have to eat the pepper soup after this. Did y'all see that? Look at me. Look at me. Y'all know what time it is now.
this is what I like to do. When I eat, <clears throat> when I eat, y'all, I like to stay busy. I like for the food to keep me busy. And that's exactly what this is doing. We got this, this pepper sauce is, it's out of this world. Scotch bonnet peppers and ginger, blended. I've never had it, that sauce. Sorry, y'all. Somebody's texting me. Oh, let me tell y'all this too. And I'll be posting this video as soon as possible. So y'all get a chance to y'all check this out. Get $12 off a uh, minimum $15 order, I believe, when you order your um, order your dinner from Africa House through Grubhub. So I just got this. My stuff came up to like $23 and some change. I just paid $8 and some change for it. It's a promotion that they're doing. <clears throat> it's not gonna last forever, of course, but get in while you can, y'all. This code has already been used, just in case y'all trying to use it. You gotta um, call, her to call the restaurant and she'll give you the code. And you order your meal through Grubhub. It's pretty cool. You know. Man. Yeah, my um actually my dinner came up to $13.99, you know, plus you add on the tax. And then their delivery charge was $5.99 six bucks and then after that I ordered I got three three mango drinks mine came up to like 23 bucks and with this thing that they got going on right now I ended up paying like eight dollars eight dollars and some change that was nice My God, y'all, this is good. Seriously. Big guy right there, look at big guy, yeah. Big guy, y'all can see this all day sitting in. Ooh, man, and I just dip him. Dip each piece in some of the oil my, and the juices and the, it's air fried. <clears throat> I've never had air fried, believe it or not. I know a lot of people talk about it, but I've never done it yet. But it's good. It's good. Really good. It's like fried fish with no um you know, it's like lightly, lightly crusted, not crusted, but lightly fried with no grease taste. You know what I'm saying? No utensils today, baby. Look at that. <laughs> See his teeth. I hope y'all don't mind me not doing as much talking as I usually do. Most people I see using um, bunku, which is what this is, 
to basically pick food up and eat with it. They normally make it into a ball. See, make it. In, they normally make it into a ball and do what they do. But I, I, I flatten mine out and I use it sort of like a tortilla shell and pick mine up like that, like a little sandwich. Really good, y'all, really good. What I should have done was order my pepper soup so I could have it on the side and taste it while I'm eating this. Y'all know I like a lot going on when I eat. I've eaten snap um, and um, tilapia from a lot of different restaurants. This one right here is definitely going to get a repeat for me. Y'all know I don't bullshit when it comes to food. Damn, that piece was good. There's so many flavors going on. That's what makes it so exciting for me. Not just one damn flavor, you know what I mean? You get a few flavors, a lot of flavors. Then they get to bouncing around your mouth with the rest of the different flavors. Yes, sir. almost a game ender right there. I got a hold of one of them bones. I hope y'all can see me pretty good because I left my uh, tripod at home. Mmm. Pepper sauce is on point. I get it behind his head by her. He wants a big hunk of meat behind his head. <clears throat> Look at that. Couple of bones, I said.
You okay?
pepper sauce, y'all. Get out of here. <laughs> Part two in a few minutes. Part two? <laughs> Part two, yes. <laughs> Say nice. We out of here. Africa House. Bye bye. <laughs> Peace out, y'all.